Let's take a look at a segment in a trapezoid that's referred to as a median. A median is a segment with its endpoints on the midpoints of the nonparallel sides. So we're going to create one in this picture. My two nonparallel sides would be my sides that are on the left and the right. I need to find the midpoints of each one, and I'm just going to do that based on appearance. So this appears to be about the middle of the left side, and this appears to be the midpoint on the right side. If I connect these two points, that forms the segment called a median. Is the blue segment a median of the trapezoid? The end points are at the middles of each of these sides. However, this is not a median. The end points and medians have to be on the non-parallel sides. They can't be on the two sides that are parallel. What my main objective is would be to find the length of a median if I know the two bases. There is a way to do that, and the length of a median is the average of the two bases. Keep in mind that the bases of a trapezoid are the two parallel sides. So what I would want to do is average those two together. So first I would add my 16 plus 2, which is 18, I divide by the number 2 because I'm averaging two numbers together. So 18 divided by 2 would be a length of 9. That means the length of my median would be 9 units long. Something else I want to look at, now that I know that my median is 9 units long, I want to look at the difference between my median length and each base. The difference between 9 and 2 is 7. The difference between 16 and 9 is also 7. That's going to hold true for medians. Now these 7s are not a length of the segments of either of those sides, but it's a difference in value between the base and the median. My next example, my two bases are 85 and 26. So I want to average those two numbers together. If you are relying on a scientific calculator to help you with numbers that are a little bit larger, keep in mind that the scientific calculators do the order of operations. My first goal is to add the two bases together. Then I want to take that answer and divide it by 2. So if you're using the calculator, make sure you find the sum first. Otherwise, the calculator is going to divide that 26 by 2 and not the whole sum of 26 plus the 85. Now my missing length for this median would be 55 and a half units long. My next example, I'm given information, so I'm just going to place that information in my picture. My longer base is 20 and the shorter base is 16. My goal is to find the length of the median. I just need to average those two numbers together. So if I add my two bases, 20 plus 16 would be 36, and next I would divide that by 2. I would get an 18 for my length, and that would be the length of my median, or segment MM. Let's take a look at this picture with information given. There's three segments that we need to find. My first segment, EF, is actually the median of the trapezoid. And I know it's a median because it's showing that these non-parallel sides are bisected. That means I would need to average my two bases, so 10 plus 4 would be 14, 14 divided by 2 would be 7. 
My next segment is segment FD. Because the median bisects this side, I can find out what the length of FD is given the information in the upper right hand corner that segment CD equals 8. That also means that segment CF should equal 4 as well. Now my last segment is segment AB, which is off to the left here. Segment EA would also have to be 6, so using segment addition, the length of segment AB would equal 12. Now we're going to use the same thing about the median being the average of the bases. But now we're going to think a little bit differently. The median length is given, but one of the bases is missing. The process won't change. So I'm going to show this. If I were to add my two bases, it would look like 6 plus x. Then I would need to divide by 2 to find its average. And I should get the value of 14. Mathematically, I would want to multiply 2 to both sides of this equation. That way my 2's would divide out. So in other words, the sum of the bases is actually equal to the median doubled. So my missing value for x would be a length of 22 units. And I'm going to put the 22 up here, and we can check our answer. I could go backwards to check that. If I average 6 and 22, so 22 plus 6 would be 28, divide it in half, and I would get 14. So now I would like you to try to find the two missing segments in each of these trapezoids. You can press pause when you're finished. You can hit play again to see the solutions. And there's my missing segments for each of the trapezoids.